Hey guys and welcome to another Blender Tool Tips video. This is a tutorial series that shows you some of the tools in Blender that you may have never heard of or would like to know more about. So the tool that we're going to be learning right now is Convert Trized Quads and what this means is converting a three-sided triangle uh, geometry to a four-sided face or a quad that's usually used in modeling. Now when you're importing your model into a game engine, it's going to triangulate your model anyway, but it's important to know exactly what you're dealing with when you're looking at tries and uh, making sure that they're in the right position. But today we're going to be looking at a function that Blender has called convert tries to quads, and this is going to allow us to convert any triangles that we have into quadrangles or squares or whatever else you want to say. Um, I like to call them quads. So I've prepared a plane today that has a mixture of quads and triangles and this is usually not really the kind of geometry you're going to be looking for. You're looking for more of an edge flow. So if you're in a, uh, a midway uh, part in your modeling and you have this problem, uh, this is a good function for you. So what you're going to do is go into edit mode, use tab, and uh, select every face with A and then you're going to pull up your blender face sub menu by hitting control F it's going to bring up all these functions and we're not going to get in that today but what you're going to want to do is click tries to quads now the hot key for this is also alt J so we'll hit tries to quads and as you'll see blender will look at all of your try divisions and do what it can to uh, turn those tries into quads and when you use that function it's going to bring your tries to quads uh, menu up here in your transform menu and uh, you have some parameters to play with here compare UVs it will look at um, the different UVs that you have for your quads and depict whether or not it wants to convert that max angle it's just sort of the same thing as intensity it's good for uh, tuning down or up your amount of conversion uh, that you want to do and uh, anyway this is a really good tool to use uh, if you want to keep your edge flow and you're wor uh, worried about tries being in your model and another way to uh, manually get rid of uh, these things is to right click on your edge, hit delete, and hit dissolve. And that's going to turn your, your uh, face into a quad by deleting and dissolving that edge. And uh, ultimately turning that into a four-sided quadrangle. So thanks a lot for watching guys. I hope you enjoyed. Comment and rate. And thank you very much.